big game. Yeah, it is a big game, man. It's a mid-table, um, mid-table <laughs> six-pointer. And the thing is, if we win, we go four points behind David Moyes' West Ham United. What a season. Mad. Four points behind Moyes. And uh, Moyes, if I check, um, would have a game in hand. <laughs> So this is the thing. I can take being behind Man City and Liverpool. I can't take being behind West Ham United. I'm sorry. No disrespect to them. They've had a great season. Yeah, but how can we justify being behind David Moyes' West Ham? I'm sorry. That's a disgrace. Absolute disgrace. We've scored 27 goals this season. Uh, West Ham has scored seven more. And... Um, it is actually crazy, isn't it, really, when you think about it? It is actually mad. And um, people are going, oh, but we've got the second best defence in the league. Yeah, we'll do get a trophy for that. Uh, you don't, do you? Uh, Tottenham are joint second with us, by the way. Actually, that's the one I wanted. My score prediction, 2-1 to the Arsenal. 2-1. And, um, yeah, I am looking forward to the game. I'm a little bit nervous, though, because I know that if we don't play properly today... Um, Jack Grealish is going to destroy us. So, yeah, man, it's a bit of a mad one. Maybe I should set up a, a pizza delivery place. Call it Datsun, Datsun Deliveries. <laughs> Watkins might wreck us. Yes, he might. He wrecked Liverpool, didn't he? Scored a hat-trick. Uh, big up to Mark. 5.30 a.m. kickoff in Canada. You, man, are mad. I swear down. You, man, are mad. Yeah, there's no way I'd be getting up at that time to watch Arsenal, mate. No chance. I, e even if I was a Liverpool or Man City fan winning title after title and stuff like that, yeah, I'd, I think I'd even struggle to to be able to do that, to watch that as well, if I'm honest. No way. No way could I do that, mate. You you guys are mad. Yeah, and fair play to all of you lot around the world to do that, man. Like, stupid o'clock. Like, look at this, look. Big up to Daniel. 4.30 in Seattle. You're a gangster, bruv. Yeah, just, just turn it off, bruv. Just go to bed. Anyone who's watching at half four in the morning, you know, or half five, or 3 a.m., or any time a.m. that's not a respectable a.m. time, just go to bed. Just go to bed. The Banter Club are in town. The Banter Club are in town. It's a 12.30 kickoff. We're crap at 12.30 kickoffs. And, um, yeah, last time we came to the Midlands was last week, and we lost to Wolves. So, yeah, it's uh, it's going to be easy. And uh, we lost to Aston Villa at their ground last season. How you doing, buddy? Yeah, I'm all right. How you doing? Yeah, I'm good, man. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Um, but, yeah, with, um, with me hair, I'm probably over six foot. <laughs> and look yeah. at the state of my hair, bro. It's a mess, bro. Look at it. Look. It's just a mess. I'm good we enough need for my hair. hair but I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go have a quick cigarette, yeah. Okay. And uh, go and grab the missus' phone so I can uh, get the game on. We'll be in sync today as well. BT Sport, innit? it? Yeah, of course, sir. Yeah, man. Um, but yeah, big up to everybody in the chat room. Uh, make sure you smash the likes. I'll big up to my boy Mohammed. Uh, big up, brother. Um, good luck to my fellow Aussie Matty Ryan. Uh, seen him play in front of an empty little grounds in Australia. Nice guy and very humble. Uh, big up to you, my guy. Liverpool are back again as well, by the way. Uh, so I, I bet you're loving life. And um, let's hope Matty Ryan um, is better than Runnison. <laughs> <laughs> Otherwise, we're in big trouble today big because they've got a sick team, mate. Their team is class, bruv. And uh, I hope you and the missus are well, Mohammed. Appreciate that, my guy, as always. Um, I'll be back in about three or four minutes, yeah? All right, go on. Oh, what a ball. Ooh. Arsenal being tested already by Villa. Oh, that's sloppy. That was sloppy. That was sloppy. That was so sloppy. That was so sloppy. Oh, my days. Oh, that was so sloppy from Cedric. So sloppy. This guy, Villa basically just from nothing, just from a little attack. Basically, they they hit they whipped in across. Um, I think it was Gabriel that basically intercepted it. It came to Cedric. Cedric, I don't know, attempted to lay it off, but didn't. 
He tried to lay it off back to to, to Gabriel. It was too short. Um, I think it was Jack Grealish that latched onto it. No, no, not Jack Grealish. It was um, uh, who's that brother? I've forgotten his name. Anyway, it's that brother basically latched onto it, crossed it into Watkins, 1-0. Only one suggestion I'll make. Get absolutely hammered. <laughs> We've woke up early for this, mate. We've woke up early for this. And, um, inside one minute, Ollie Watkins. Cheers. Thanks. Well done. You might as well cash out, by the way. <laughs> give, me two, give me two seconds. Give me two yeah, seconds. yeah, go on, mate. Go on. You might as well cash out, mate. This is a shambles, man. I, I can and can I just say as well, right? I just see the goal a minute ago downstairs. Can I just say as well, yeah? This is mad, right? So the goal, I've seen it. What is Rob Holding doing, number one? And then what is the goalkeeper doing? Like his reactions were just non. He was just non-reactive. It's mad. Absolutely mad. Absolute shambles. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. It's just a joke, isn't it? Like, you sit here, and, and every time I'm confident as well, it ends up with, oh, I swear, this is so boring, man. Every single week. Apparently, he's taken us forward. He's improved us. He has improved us. We're going to equal our losses from last season if this carries on inside 23 games. We've actually done it. If we lose today... We have actually equaled last week's, uh, last year's losses. 15 games quicker. And, uh, yeah, another record broken. It's Carl Bovis, his name is, yeah? Uh, big up to him. Yeah, I'm sure he's a... Uh, sure, I've never met him, like I said. I'm sure he's a sound guy, yeah? Bruv, where, where's the tweet that he tweeted me? Where is it? I want to find it. There's no point arguing with you because you're too set in your ways. But if you're saying that you can't see any improvement in the team, then I question your understanding of football. We all want titles. They don't come overnight. Well, they did for Leicester. They did for Chelsea. They did for Man City. Yeah, like, come on, seriously. All right. So I put Carl with 10th, seven points behind David Moyes' West Ham. Call City and Liverpool, but explain West Ham. Moyes had got the job nine days after Arteta and also had COVID with a, and got a worse squad. But that's a shambles. We've gone backwards with this manager. The league table don't lie. And they don't. If we lose today, that's 10 losses, which is what we had last season. We also had 10 losses the season before. If we lose today, he's got 10 losses, 15 games quicker than the other two seasons. That's a joke. How can anyone say, yeah, how can anybody say that they have, that is an improvement? I don't get it. But it's literally not an improvement. When you, when you think we've had three it. transfer windows and we've gone backwards. Well, let's forget the nuances. Forget the nuances for a second. You've gone from 8th to 13th. Yeah. Well, 10th at the minute. Or 10th. Wherever we're going to end up. Mm. Do, you, do you think we're ending up 8th? I don't think so. Nope. When we win, fantastic uh, young, best young manager. When we lose, the players' fault. We need to bin the Wenger players. Exactly. And this is the thing, yeah? Both. He could have binned Bellerin. He could have binned Xhaka. He could have binned Holding. He chose to keep them. All three of them could have left. Xhaka was out, out the door. He was going to Germany. He convinced him to stay. His words. You know? And this is the thing, yeah? Like, so some somebody else replied to that tweet last night. And said something along the lines of, um, yeah, he's too set in his ways. He's dug a big hole and it's too far for him to go back now. So I just put Arteta as quote. Eighth and an FA Cup is not good enough for Arsenal. I put about big hole. Yeah, that's your manager's words, mate, not mine. Yeah, eighth in the FA Cup is not good enough for Arsenal. Well, you've knocked us out the FA Cup to then go and get four points out of your next three league games and losing after one minute against Villa. You knocked us out of the cup for that. But that that would be that would be one for the uh, for the VAR is against us merchants, wouldn't it? Oh, he's the last man. He was clean through. Uh, Saka's still down on the floor, by the way. This this ain't good. Lacazette's moaning, yeah, 
And the referee saying, listen, you pussy old. I know you're dropping a one out of 10 because I just watched Gunner stream a minute ago and he said your face looks like fucking it does when you drop a one out of 10. <laughs> Arteta's moaning to the fourth official. Shut up, mate. Yeah, shut up, you absolute fraud. Shut up, you melt. Shut up, you melt. <laughs> you say you, you say you, you melt. You say you, yeah. You say you. <laughs> Look at Grealish, bruv. Grealish is just twisting everyone up. Look at him, look. This is crap. Look at Bellerin's position now, yeah? Look at Bellerin's position. Look, he's playing right forward as we speak, yeah? Right? And he hasn't, he's still jogging, yeah? He's making no attempt to get back into position, yeah? Right? They've lost, we've lost the ball again, yeah? And they've got a free kick. Bellerin's now jogging back. Bruv, he is fucking useless. I'm sorry, I don't care what anyone tells me, he is useless. Absolutely useless. Again, you'll see, Ross Barkley's not been picked up once. No, he ain't. Not, not, not even once. It's bruv, bruv, he's got the freedom of Villa Park, it's pathetic. Like I thought, I thought at some point Arteta would have noticed and would have got our um, party to just. Oh, uh, Arteta could do it once. He's only there because he's got nice hair, mate. He's got perfect hair, mate. I, I've been, wa I've been watching Barkley for mm. probably a good twenty minutes, and he's not been picked up once. It, it, it doesn't matter whether we win any football matches. Because you're concerned with uh, hacking down Grealish. It's like uh, maybe these motherfuckers have other ballers in the team, right? Yeah. We're just so weak on the on the tackle. Do you see how much I hate? Yeah, look, they're away, yeah? They're away. They've got a three-on-three. Three. Bellerin's nowhere to be seen. Watkins. Oh, good save by Ryan. He's parried it to Grealish. It was a good save, though. Grealish is one-on-one -on -one with Holden. Oh, my God. Look at him. He's taking the piss out of him again, for fuck's sake. Look, Ross Barkley's just spinning man up. This is a joke, bruv. They're just taking the fucking piss. Too many techie ballers in the box, bruv. Target with a cross. That's a good cross as well. Watkins. Oh, straight at the keeper. Thank fuck for that. This is mad how shit we are. Uh, at what minute do you reckon William's coming on? Uh, 10 minutes. Mm. That was a good save from Ryan. He parried that right out of the way as well. But we're in, we're in serious trouble here. Who is it that completely missed that tackle? Um, I think, I think it was Bellerin. Oh, it was Bellerin, okay. Yeah, I think it was Bellerin. Go on, Pepe. Come on, do something, man. Yeah, Bell go on. Cedric, cross it. It's a good cross, but it was straight, straight there. Man, why are they always first to everything? This is depressing, bruv. We've got nobody there, bruv. Look, they're winning every ball. Look, Grealish is away, boy. Look at Bellerin. Well out of position again. Look at him. He still can't get back. They're in. Barkley. Oh, wow. He shanked that. Unbelievable, Jeff. Unbelievable, Jeff. They are all like... Look at, look at how far Bellerin is behind Grealish. Look at him. And he's sprinting full pelt. He still couldn't catch him. <laughs> By the way, that was You're a good. fucking dog shit, mate. You are absolutely absolute, absolute, absolute dog shit. Waste. He's, like, he's, actually, look, he's spitting full pelt. Grealish is just jogging, bruv. We got lucky with that. It was Thomas Party who gave it away that time. It's just like, it, it looks like they just like, as soon as the ball gets given away, they've, they've, they've kind of resigned themselves to the fact that Villa are better than us. Party's been yellow carded as well, by the way. Right, we've got a break here. We've got a break. Go on. Peps. Come inside. Go on. Oh, that was so close, Peps, man. That's better. Good little oh. break. Close, wasn't it? Back to oh, my mate, back to goal my... gaping as well. Look at it. Oh, about a foot and a half wide. Mad. Yeah, George has got it spot on. Just look at the difference in quality from both teams. Exactly. 
Well, they've got Ross Barkley. Our fans would have laughed if we had signed Ross Barkley. Yeah, Ross Barkley is a baller, bruv. Yeah, Jack Grealish, baller. Traore, baller. Cash, baller. Watkins, baller. Look at him. They want it more. Look at him. Look, look at look at Cash, bruv. Cash has just dribbled around about six men. He's literally just dribbled around six men. This is mad, bruv. How can their right back be better than our right back? It's Aston Villa, bruv. This is bad, man. This is proper bad. Absolutely pathetic. Absolutely pathetic. What will today's excuse be if we lose? Oh, the players let him down. Look at him. I fucking can't stand Artel. You know, you know, when I look at Wenger, I just think you set my club back a decade, yeah? Right? It's yeah. exactly the feeling I'm getting with this guy. Every time I see him, I just think you've just you've just totally conned a whole fan base. Yeah, with your PR gump. They're just taking the piss. Look, we're not even pressing, bruv. Look, there's no press. There's nothing. We've got about eight men behind the ball and they're just all stood there, bruv. Look, everyone's behind the ball. Look, at, yeah, he's going to hit that. Oh, my God, Ryan, good save. I'll tell you what, his punching away from goal is very good. I hate his starting position, though. He, he does always look like he's out of position, doesn't he? Yeah. That was a good one, though. He, and to be fair, he could have caught that. This is crap. This is actually crap. That's a bit better. All right, look. Look at Bellerin. Bob, you, you're not going to overtake anyone. You're too slow. Give it back to Saka. Oh, my God, he is fucking shit. Watch this. Watch this, what Bellerin just does. Watch what Bellerin just does. Just watch. <laughs> what? What? Smith Rowe. Yeah. Smith Rowe. Oh, my God, he went around the whole team. He's just skinned Matt Cash and given a goal kick away. <laughs> fucking hell, I swear. Well, you just got to laugh. It's it's just ridiculous. We've improved. We've imp if you can't see that we've improved, your footballing knowledge is in the gutter, apparently. Yeah, if you can't see that this manager's dog shit, yeah, then you're lying through your fucking teeth. Unbelievable, Jeff. Why does the assistant manager for Aston Villa look like a fucking bulked up, juiced up fucking Glenn Hoddle? <laughs> well, he does, doesn't he? It looks like a juiced up Glenn Hoddle, bruv. It does, isn't it? <laughs> Man, it looks like a juiced up Glenn Hoddle, bruv. We're fucking shit. I wouldn't oh, be surprised. Oh, look, I wouldn't be surprised if they get another goal as well. Yeah, Jack Grealish has just introduced Odegaard to physicality. <laughs> yeah, look, 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 and then Grealish wins a free kick. Shaka again. He's such a clever footballer, Grealish, man. Him and Harry Kane are probably the fucking smartest footballing fucking brains in the Premier League. Do you know that? Who are they subbing off here? What are they doing here? Man's just adjusting his crown jewels. Ross Barkley's coming off. Thank fuck for that. They're bringing on Ramsey, not Aaron. Not Aaron, but they're bringing on Ramsey. Don't be going away. Here we go. Look, they've just given Ollie Watkins the ball. Xhaka ain't got a clue what day it is. Grealish, one-on-one -on -one with Bellerin. Here we go. Oh, whoa, what a save, Matt Ryan. Fucking hell. That, this game has made some good saves. Are bro, you impressed yet? Too? Bro, he's made some good saves. I can't lie. Bro, oh, my God. We've played Watkins in again. William this time. Good recovery from Gabriel. This is pathetic. Did you see the way he just spun Bellerin like nothing, bruv? He was just like, I'll just shift it and bang it straight. Yeah. Pathetic. Well, it, it, the minute you said Bellerin was the last line of defence. Yeah, when it's Grealish well, against Bellerin, bruv, I'm sorry. Yeah, I thought, I'm sorry. okay. <laughs> I know what time it is. <laughs> We've still got the ball. If, yeah. This geezer has had three transfer windows and took us from fucking eighth to tenth. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It took us from 8th to 10th. We could potentially be 13th if we don't win this game. William with a oh, ball. 
But I'll catch a ring. Hey, you want? And two, so look like a great. And Emmy Martinez has the ball. <laughs> Three of their players are down in the box. <laughs> the, them two look like it. a great investment now. <laughs> look at this chance from Grealish again. Look, just they weren't. It was basic fucking defending, and Bellerin couldn't do it, bro. He didn't do any magical skill. He just shifted the ball and pinged it. It was a good save, good save. And and do you know what I liked? I've liked about this goalkeeper's saves today. Yeah, I'm just watching Barkley again kick the ball. Fucking few. I know. I know exactly what you're about to say. <laughs> He passed them away from the, key, the, the the goal. Yeah, miles away from the danger. Fucking 20 in this league in midfield, unfortunately. Uh, good player. <laughs> Famous <laughs> last night. Come on, other guy. Let's go. It's true. No, no, listen, I don't dislike him. Yeah, I, I wish we'd signed him permanently rather than just a... It is about 10 games that you're going to get if you're lucky. Um, He should have scored. He should have scored. But it's the thing, like, Granite Xhaka, Rob Holding, Yeah. Look, Rob Holden again. Oh, my God. He has just given fucking Ollie Watkins a free run at goal. You useless dog shit footballer. Jack Grealish. Jack Grealish. Back to Watkins. Who's just absolute... Oh, my God. Ryan again. Oh, my God. They're in here. Oh, what's the keeper doing? They're in here. Oh, my God. Bro. This is Panic Station FC. Fuck here. Now, what is Rob Holden doing? And then look at look at Grealish. Look, Rob Holding don't know what to do. Watkins was offside. Thank fuck for that. This is just fucking ridiculous, bruv. Another good save though. Another good one where he's parried it and made it difficult for you to have a tap in. You see what I'm saying? Look, spoons up off of him. This is fucking ridiculous, bruv. Rob Holding is dog shit. He's fucking shit. I don't care what anyone tells me. I don't care if he's had a fucking purple patch where he's had four or five good games. Whoop he fucking do. The geezer is dog shit. Go back to Bolton. Yeah. Oh, but uh, but uh, I'm sorry he didn't cost £50 million, so he cannot be good. No, he's not good, mate. Yeah. Reality check. He's worth £2.5 million because he's shit. Fucking useless. Absolute. Rob, Ollie Watkins has absolutely bullied that fucker all day. All day, every header, yeah. Ollie Watkins has won every time he's got the ball, yeah. Rob Holding, he's nicked it off of him and fucking passed him in, yeah. Useless, Ollie Watkins, all day long, man of the match, bruv. All day long, man of the match. If we're picking a man of the match for Arsenal, by the way, yeah, um, it, we could be here all fucking week because they're all shit. Oh, shit. every single one of them's been shit today. In fact, that's a lie. The goalkeeper's man of the match. Look here, look. Bellerin's just been bodied again. Fuck off. You useless cunt. You fucking useless prick. Do you know what? There'll be people sitting there going, you're so negative, yeah? Can you imagine if there was Arsenal fans in the away end? Yeah, you do. You do some colourful language in the fucking away end, trust me. Although saying that, if if Emmy Martinez was running at me full pelt, I'd probably bottle it as well. <laughs> He's a big lad, isn't he? Big boy. Yeah, you wouldn't want him falling on top of you, mate. That's going to hurt. William is uh, is now getting bullied. Oh, granite, Xhaka, you wank! Look at this ball from Xhaka. Just watch this ball. He plays this ball blind, straight to no one. Here we go, Bellerin down the right. Two and a half minutes of stoppage time to go. He's played it to Pep. Come on, Pepe, do something. Pepe inside. That Matt Target's a fucking... Um, is it Matt Target? Is that his name? He's a good yeah. left-back, he is. Left-back, yeah. Yeah, he's a good for a while. Odegaard. Odegaard. Saka. Odegaard. Pepe. And Jack Grealish is just... Body, uh, just just took it straight past Bellerin like it was nothing. Look, look, at, look at Grealish. He's just toying with, man. Yeah, he's just toying with, man. Yeah, and then Grealish has come back and done Bellerin again. <laughs> Fucking hell. Bro, watch this. Bro, bro look, look at Grealish, bro. Man's just selling souls, bro. Selling dreams. Yeah? Jack Grealish is a fucking baller. What a footballer. Yeah? What a footballer. Yeah? Just watch this pattern of play. 
Leaves Bellerin after, yeah, then leaves Rob Holding, see ya, skips inside, and then Granite Xhaka takes him out. <laughs> 